This is our 1971 VW camper van. It's an early bay and like many early bays it's got plenty of rust. We've been going around cutting out the rusty parts and welding in new parts and that's what we're going to do today on the passenger door. So come with us and you'll see us break down the door and cut off the old rusty bits. The first job is to break all the parts of the door down. Uh, there's a lot of bits on a T2 door and some of them are a pain in the backside to get out. Uh, but it's mainly just nuts and bolts, screws, clips. Uh, the main thing is getting the window winder out. The reason I'm doing this is because I'm going to be grinding, going to be welding and the last thing we want is loads of hot metal to stick to the window. Stripping this door down took about 30 minutes, but this is the second one. I've already done the driver's door, so that makes it a lot easier. I am replacing all of the door seals, window seals and trim pieces here, so that's less of an issue for me. But some of the clips and bits and pieces are very fragile, so take care. Long nose pliers and a flat blade screwdriver will help you out a lot. Sorry about the lack of guard on my grinder here. Um, it's an old grinder, the guard's long gone. Um, you should not do what I'm doing. You should have your guard on, you should have all of your PPE on, and don't be an idiot like me. These 1mm cutting discs work really well on body panels, but they're way cheaper in a 5 inch rather than a 4 inch. I've got a 4 inch grinder, which is the other reason that there's no guard on the thing. Get yourself a 5 inch grinder and you'll save a fortune in cutting and grinding discs.
Boy, there's a lot of rust in this door. Way more than I thought there'd be. So I've had to order some more parts. I've ordered some box section steel to replace this box section support piece inside the door. And uh, obviously we've got that other repair panel that we've already got, plus a door skin coming. So the next video will be uh, me welding all of that stuff in, cutting out some more rust and welding yet more stuff in. Cheers and uh, thanks for watching.